Hey, Grumpy, what is up? <laughs> He's sleeping in front of your car. Yo, 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 everyone, welcome to another vlog. So today, or right now, we're actually going to get my sister's car cleaned. We haven't done it for a long time. Grumpy, are you going to let us go? What's up, man? What's up? Look, I'm your friend. We're friends. Okay, bye-bye. We're not friends anymore. But yeah, my sister's car is absolutely filthy, guys. Like, what? Do you, do you see all of them white dots? That's mud. Okay, we need to get this car cleaned as soon as possible because of all the rain. And yeah, we can start heading out today. Ready? Let's go. By the way, Grumpy is just patrolling the streets today. Yo, what's up, man? Come back. Come back. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna drop the car in now guys and go inside and see what's up over there Yeah, back at my favorite car wash. All right boys So I know you guys have been waiting for me to show you the lineup over here So let's get straight into it So we actually saw this car last time the classic Ferrari and then we have another Ferrari not bad not bad two Ferraris next to each other then we actually have a really cool Range Rover Sport love this car and okay I'm gonna get onto this car because last time you guys killed me because you were like, Mo, you didn't focus on the Lycan, you ignored the Lycan, so I'm really, really sorry guys. Remember I told you that this was the one that was actually in the movie, and they like ran through buildings with it and stuff like that. You can even see the mirror has been like ripped off doing that stuff, and even the interior has been mashed up. Like, I'm not sure how well you guys can see that. The interior is like torn to bits, but... There's some other really, really cool cars over here. We actually have a 458, as you can see. There you go. And next to it is one of my favorite cars, the GT3 RS. So, not a bad lineup at all over here. Really, really amazing cars. And I completely forgot, we have a white Rolls Royce, which is really, really awesome. So, yeah. As you can see, we finished up at the car wash and we're in the car heading off home. Car is looking super clean, but it's actually probably going to start raining soon. And that's why we're rushing home right now, because there's a lot of clouds. It's got a little rain at the moment, but it's not really fully. And as you can see, we're trying to get home as soon as possible right now. So, yeah, we should be there soon, hopefully. And I just hope it doesn't start raining. Look how cloudy it is. Anyways, boys, we made it home. We're quickly actually going to go grab the cover for this car and put it on because as you can see it's a bit cloudy in the sky and we don't want it to get dirty because tomorrow we're going for this event with the car so you know trying to keep it clean for now my mom and grandma are actually not home right now we have to open the door for once we're learning how to use a key <laughs> all right let's go it's so dark it's not even that late guys oh it's like we're in a ghost house Crikey, mate. Crikey, guys. Ooh, okay. Now we have some life. And look at what we're popping out after ages. Do you guys remember this bad boy? Do you remember it? <laughs> we used to cover the car with this every single day. Anyways, let's go put this bad boy on the car. And we need to head out to go to the central post office because we got lots of stuff from you guys that are stuck in customs. Yo, hurry up, let's quickly cover it so we can go. See you soon, buddy, see you soon. For now, you're gone. Yo, it's stuck under your plate. <laughs> there you go. And there you go, boys. The car is gone. I actually really miss this kind of look it has to it when it's covered. It looks funky, right? So as I promised you guys yesterday, we're going to cut to yesterday's section of the vlog, which I didn't show you. Basically, we went to Ajman for like a meeting and ended up doing loads and loads of cool things. So we're going to cut back to that. Enjoy it. It is absolutely amazing. And if you're wondering why I'm wearing the same clothes, it's because the clips are from yesterday. So I hope you enjoy it. Smash the like button if you do. And then we'll be back to continue today's vlog. All right. Peace. All right, so I made it over to my meeting, guys. This is Sultan. He's really cool. We're talking about some big news that's actually happening on Friday, so expect something really, really cool. But for now, we're going for a drive in a SNS. 
Yes. So yes. let's go for a hectic drive. All right, let's go. So there's actually something special about this SLS which Sultan wants to tell you. So what is it? This car has a long tube headers, okay, yeah. and tuned by Mr. Matthias, custom tuned. We tune it for the Super Sprint Day. You're that means there's a lot of power in this car. So let's go for a drive and see what it is. In basic terms, it's going to go very fast, all right? Here goes nothing, boys. Uh, whoa. All right. Let's go. We're in the SNS right now and I want to show you the interior. It looks really cool. Something I love generally about Mercedes guys is these like the fans look like you know them air turbines which is really really cool so here goes nothing boys. Are you ready? Am I ready? <laughs> I don't know. Okay I'm ready. There you go guys, that is I think the fastest I've ever been in. The fastest car, wow. All right guys, that was an insane ride, amazing stuff there. One more look at the interior, but for now I'm gonna hop out. Wow, that one acceleration showed me my whole life, like my whole life flashed between my eyes there. I'm actually going on a ride in this Gallardo Super Traferlo. Trilogy. I'm so bad at pronouncing names, but this is the only white one in the Gulf region. Overall, there's like 150. Should be awesome. Let's go for a quick ride inside this bad boy. Oh my god. Let's go. So this is Khaled, guys, and he owns this car, so I thought it'd be best for him to tell you about the car. So what is it? Okay, sure. It's called the Gallardo Super Triface Totali. All right. They made the 150 of those cars. Uh, and uh, they give it to selected people wow. depending on their, their previous uh, supercar collection now this car is completely built for uh, racing yeah. Yeah. in the tracks right, so, sorry. <laughs> so basically this is why the whole car is made of carbon fiber as wow. you can see the whole door okay, is from yeah, carbon fiber them. wow look at this whole panel is like carbon fiber complete, complete carbon fiber package the more you say this I'm scared like <laughs> it just sounds faster and faster every time it jumps and people actually think that the engine is going to break because it switches that hub which way should I record the street or my face well, uh, it's, it's up to you okay like, let's get them to see the street all right guys here goes nothing are you ready yeah, why not? Does it make a difference? <laughs> yes! <laughs> wow, there's a lot of kick on this car. What? <laughs> there you go guys, that was an insane ride. <laughs> wow yo that was an insane experience right there guys i swear like today my heart is gonna level up like it's gonna get more resilient to things like this because trust me when i say this bad boy was fast wow like now when i look at gallardo's and i know this is a special version and can't compare it to normal ones but it's just giving me like a whole <laughs> whole new perspective of Galar's. <laughs> We're actually gonna go for a ride in Sultan's G-Wagon right now. And this car is really, really special. And I'll tell you the couple of ways. Number one, I saw it says Ohlins here. And I asked, I was like, what is that? Apparently, the Ohlins, it has an Ohlins suspension. And that is no regular suspension. You actually cannot even buy that, like, unless you have, like, a... These suspensions are in Aventadors, in Bugattis, in P1s. And you'll never find it on a normal G-Wagon like this unless you specifically get it. So that is really cool. We're actually going to go for a ride in it. Apparently, you could, like, fly over bumps and not even feel them, which is super cool. So, yeah. All right, let's go for a ride. Woo! First ride in a G-Wagon. 
one thing I actually have never noticed about a G-Wagon is you're actually really, really high in the road. Like, our Range Rover, I don't think it was this high. Like, I feel like I'm on top of the road right now. So that's really, really awesome. Anyways, look at the view you get. By the way, guys, the suspension means that it's going to be really smooth on a speed bump, as you can see. Oh, my God. <laughs> but there you go, guys. That's, like, just to show you how good the suspension on this car is. Like, we went over a speed bump 70 kilometers an hour, which, on my car, there would be nothing left. Like, the Mustang's gone. But we, we went over it with ease. Another test on the bump, guys. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> I feel like we're flying. <laughs> That is awesome. <laughs> See the things? They're like nothing. <laughs> wow. It's like a straight road. <laughs> Speed bumps in this car are nothing. Look, we're coming up to one now. Oh! <laughs> I got so scared. Check out the drinks over here, guys. Wow, they're actually steaming. Look at that. You wanna see this? Wow, it's bubbling. Yeah. Does it give it color? No, test. Okay. Wow. Now you give it back because unleak it to the video. Now you need to mix it. You know what this white thing? No. They call it dry ice. Wow, okay. Yeah, so she's the one she's making, you know. We came to this burger joint and look what they have. They actually That's have that. like colored burgers, which is really, really cool. Like. Look at that. They've got a pink burger, an orange burger, and a green one. That is really, really awesome. Really cool stuff over here. Anyways, guys, we're going to head off home now. We had our little meeting over here. Really, really awesome cars we checked out as well. I swear, my car has recently started beeping a lot. Do you think it's because of the door? It's the alarm. Look, it says it. It's the door. It's the door. It's not even the alarm. I don't even know what it is. It's annoying. That's what it is. That's what it is. I need to go fix that. Anyways, let's go boys. Did you see the cars we tried to do? Did you see the cars? <laughs> Yo, I swear I've never been so scared in my life. Like that was madness. Like guys, I've been in Bugattis, but we have never been that fast. Like that was, it was just insane. So I'm actually gonna head off to the central post office by myself, guys. I've actually got the slips I need, which is these two. So let's go pick up the stuff that went through customs and see what that is. And then I'm gonna go pick up my mum and grandma because they went shopping on like the other side of Dubai to where we live, which is like half an hour away. And that's where I'm picking this stuff up. So it kinda, it makes sense to do that while I'm there as well. Anyways, let's head out with my car right now. Get this bad boy turned on. Look, I've got a load of snacks for the way there. Got these, had a load of them yesterday. My car is like a food machine over here. Let's close the door. I had some really cool information to share to you guys because this morning I was actually mentioned on the radio and I'll tell you how it happened. One of you guys actually mentioned me. Basically the radio said, like the radio station said, oh guys, call in and tell me what you do when you're bored. You know, the standard radio stuff. And one of you guys, one of the yoyos got called in and said, I watch Mo Vlogs. Yo, sat nav. I'm trying to say a story right here, okay? But yeah, one of you guys said I watch Mo Vlogs, which was really, really awesome. I wish I could get so I don't know, I don't have a recording of it, but if one of you guys do, please send it in. Like that'd be so awesome to see. But yeah, thank you. Thank you for mentioning me once you get like the chance to call me. I'm gonna be honest, I'm super annoyed right now. You know when your sat nav tells you to do something dumb, like so dumb. It told me turn right and then turn left. I turn right, oh, you went the wrong way. You told me to turn right. It told me to turn right to go to a road that doesn't even take me the right way. And then now, look, look at this, look at this BS. Please, I have to take a U-turn and go back onto that busy road, which I was already on kind of progressing and now I have to go right where I started again and as as if I wasn't late already you know what I think it's confirmed like I've got 15 minutes to get there 15 minutes and it's like at least 15 minutes away without traffic so yeah pretty much screwed I don't think we're gonna get the packages today so <sighs> so annoying so annoying oh God, all right I think I just about made it please 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 Come on, be open, be open, guys. It should be open right now. Yes, it's open, it's open, it's open. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Ah. Oh. 
they they weren't open guys basically I don't know I got here five minutes to nine they technically close at nine but I think because it's the weekend they might close a bit earlier which uh, I guess it is what it is man it is what it is all right I actually ran into some of your squad in the mall right now so what's yeah. up guys they are official Yo Yo Squad. Squad. They know we about it. We love you, bro. We love, we love you, man. Oh, oh, yeah, another one. Another one. Thank you, guys. Another one. Goodbye. All right. Peace out, Go guys. Go by your family out there. All right. Give peace. me money in seven seconds. Big deal. Watch this. Today's Follow vlog. me and his smart boy Instagram. And my YouTube channel and his smart boy. <laughs> I make All music right. videos. That is amazing. <laughs> I just finished eating and I met so many of you cool guys in the food court. I can't even lie, I think I met about five or six of you at least. We're now in Super Dry with Grandma, Mo and Mummy as you can see. And I'm going to go try some shirts out because I swear I'm running out of shirts to swap out every day. And I'm just trying to see if I can get any colors that I haven't had before. So let's close. The changing room, and I picked out this one because it's kind of got a weird blue that I've never had before. So let's see if it actually fits nicely. I, I didn't really like it either, guys. I don't know. The thing is, it's kind of like itchy. I'm not sure if it's just the tag that's making me itch a lot. And I don't know. I feel, I feel like it's thick. Like I kind of like the really thin ones that you can't feel because it gets so hot. So. I don't know, for now I'm going to say no for this. Let's try a couple more on in other stores as well. Let's see what's up. I'm in another changing room right now and I've got a lot more pieces to try on right now. So, we're going to flick through a couple of these shirts and see if I like any of the colors, okay? Okay, first piece guys. I actually really like it. Okay, that's a success. Alright. Let's go to the second one. Second piece. I'm not too sure. <laughs> it kind of looks nice, but it feels really tight on the arms. I don't know. We'll keep this to the side for now. Alright guys, my mum approves of this one, so that's two yeses for now. Alright, these two, okay? Alright, that's a wrap guys. Success. Anyways, we're just going to head off home right now, but before we left, you guys know how I feel about my Korok tea and Granny Mo is also having it. Do you see her in her hand? You know, it runs in the family right now, so... I know how much you guys yeah, love Grandma Mo. From William Wesley, you can never check me. Back to back for the niggas that didn't get the message. Back to back like I'm on the cover of Lethal Weapon. Back to back like I'm Jordan 96, 97, whoa. And fuck you left the boy, no options. I wanna see my niggas go insane. Hey, 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 okay, she likes this song. Hey, we got a smile. We got a smile. Karak T gang, yo, what's up? Tony Lewis squad, what's up, man? What's up? <laughs> so here you go, guys. This is the new shirt I got. And this is the one that I really, okay, guys. All right, I'm trying to show you my new shirt. And Bubbles over here won't stop playing with the packet like he just chucked it on the floor I also got this shirt, but I don't know this one is like it's all right if you know what I mean like I personally don't like it that much like I like it, but not as much as the one I'm wearing right now so This is going to be the shirt that I overwear a lot because I don't know I just like the colorway on this thing. It's nice. It's got dark colors, which I prefer and yeah, it's got like a little bit of flavor in the middle. So yeah, I'm gonna be over wearing this a lot from now on probably. This one, the other one, as I said, eh, I'm gonna wear it a little bit, so yeah. At the moment, I need to prepare some stuff for an event that we are going to. I need to get my GoPro charged up. If you can see, it's on its little selfie stick. Have I ever showed you guys the GoPro on its selfie stick? Let me put the camera here and let me fully extend it out. So in events, when you see I have like a camera outside the car, this is what I extend. And I kind of just put this out the window and I'm like holding it like that. I've actually got another suction mount to go with it. This is like to put it outside the cars, but I've actually never put it on a car because I've been scared it will fall off. But I think I might try it out for the first time. So I've been really, really busy today trying to organize my life, <sighs> but it never works out. It never works. You guys already know that. Organizing your life never works out. I'm gonna take the swag way out again. Let's go for a ride. Whoa. <laughs> I just realized I still have the tag on my new shirt. You know what's really funny, guys? 
My mom doesn't even know I'm outside right now, so when she comes downstairs, she might freak out saying, where the hell is Mo? Okay, there's a car in the road. Anyways, my neighbors are probably looking at me like, what is this guy doing in the middle of the night? So I'm actually outside because I wanted to wrap up today's vlog here. Thought it'd be a bit different than usual because I always sit inside at my table when I wrap up the vlog and I was like, nah, we ain't doing that today. But I hope you have enjoyed today's vlog. I'm sorry it's been really hectic and all over the place. To be honest, I've just been getting myself prepared for loads of events that are coming up. Like next week, I think we have three events. And I say events, I mean like planned out stuff so one of them is going to be like a water activity day another one's going to be like some classic car event that's going to happen that i've been invited to like the premiere so it should be really really cool just been getting my stuff charged up and memories cleared and stuff like that so i hope you guys have enjoyed see you guys tomorrow for a really really cool vlog and yeah stay awesome everybody yalla yolo goodbye